Hi and welcome to the week 13 show and tell for 100 days of anthropology stories. We are getting really close to the end and I'm very excited to have almost completed this entire 100 days. So let's do a walkthrough um, real quick of the um, pieces from week 13. This is day 85 and this was done with one of my art pop cards, an art pop tab, and I actually built this one up a little bit like I've done so many where I've added pieces together. And then the photograph here is this little um, teacup Yorkie on um, a sofa. And actually my sister uh, has a dog named Bart who is a teacup Yorkie and I did the little story um, around him. So that's day 85. Day 86, another one kind of built up with uh, watercolor papers and pieces and then I covered a tag with some um, printed uh, newsprint and just some random under paper and then added some other elements I did some little painted doodle marks we did some stitching and um, and this one from the anthropology catalog is a red sofa and that was day 86 this is day 87 and this again was a piece of watercolor paper and this one has been layered with some of my art pop stickers and there's several uh, stencils and rubber stamps throughout here, an art pop tab, and the image from the anthropology catalog is this little tiny, um, I believe this is, uh, it might be a raccoon or a fox, I can't recall. So that is day 87. Day 88 uh, was actually filmed, so I did a um, video on this one by special request, and it is um, a little like a pocket here there's like a side pocket I was using some scraps and I thought hmm this might make a nice little pocket and then I just did this like little uh, tab kind of like a little bookmark but not exactly and the uh, little tab fits right inside the pocket and the image is of a radiator it looks like and a potted some potted plants all right, this is day 89, a little bit of a different departure from what I've been doing. This is actually an old cabinet card, and I covered the photo um, with a picture from the anthropology catalog. I loved it because it was very vintage looking, added a little bit of scrap paper, and then this is actually from the catalog too, and it reads, in the still before the dawn, and so that's how I started the story. And then I just added this piece I cut off of a an old piece that I had in my scraps that I had worked with and cut up and it had some sari ribbon on it and I added in it because it matched it perfectly. Not quite as colorful as my others but all right and this is day 90. This one I really struggled with and it was interesting because I got a, a good response from this one. I just really maybe it's because I'm at day 90 and I'm just really having trouble with ideas and just making this work but um, I ended up tearing up another, uh, it was a piece that I had created and I glued it on the bottom and I just kept building it up. And what I did is, you know, it just wasn't working and so I just kept, um, rather than forcing it with what I was working with, I just uh, tossed that aside and grabbed some other pieces and just kept working. So this one's built up as well, just some torn papers um, all layered together and that's a little golden apple in the picture. All right, so that's day 90, day 91 is um, a, it's sort of a built up tag. There's an art pop card at the bottom. There's some uh, watercolor paper that I've been layering on and then I tore a tag here and stitched that at the top. And the image from the catalog is this little uh, word. It's June. It was uh, just from one of the little pictures and I thought that would be a nice compliment. And then I just cut little circles out from my own artwork to kind of coordinate with some of the circles in the art pop card. So that is day 91, and that concludes week 13 of 100 Days of Anthropology Stories. Thanks for following along, and until next time, have a good day. Bye-bye.